I found something before we get started with uh, our uh, intentions. I was messing around <laughs> online just after I talked to you. Um, and I found something about Mercury retrograde, which actually is happening today. Uh-oh, no wonder. <laughs> <laughs> um, Josephine, can you hear me okay? Yeah. Oh, great. Okay. Can she see you? Uh-huh. She can see me. And I can see her. And I think we actually got this set up right now. <laughs> I'm going to uh, pass this around so everybody can get one. We're going to read it out loud because it's got some really good information on it for us to pay attention to. You know, we, we talk about um, being spiritual warriors and spiritual light workers, and that's all well and good, but if you don't do anything about it, you don't, you don't actually do your work, then nothing happens. <laughs> intention is good, but action has to be put behind intention, right? So what, what this lady had, to, this was um, Elizabeth Peru. Um, I've got her um, website here, and... Josephine, I will send you a link to this later on today. If you, She's actually on uh, Facebook, and that's where I found this. Mercury retrograde begins. Um, and the, as she wrote it, it was about 12 hours from now. Um, from our perspective on Earth, we appear to take the lead from Mercury in our orbit around the sun. We say that Mercury is trailing behind us in retrograde. Now that's a point that we all get scared. <coughs> oh no, it must be Mercury in retrograde. That's why everything's going wrong. Because we can blame Mercury for doing that. Um, this is a revealing and exciting three-week period ahead until March the 18th. Mercury is the messenger. And now we take full responsibility for this role too. We're actually living here, so we have to take responsibility for what's going on. This means get busy overhauling the way you communicate yourself to the world. And you can see we had a few glitches to start with, but we got it under control. Uh, we are not at the mercy of haphazard electrical technology over this period. We are in our power to overcome all of the loose ends that we have been denying and shunning in regards to business matters, personal relationships, family issues, um, career advancement, and you name it. Whatever you have been overlooking, now you can move through it with a fine tooth comb. You have energy available to you to get sharp, witty, alert, and doing the uh, work to get your affairs in tip-top shape. Use this period by not burying your head in the ground and guarantee that you will love it and look forward to every Mercury retrograde. Now isn't that a different perspective? Yeah, really. But it does give us back our power instead of complaining and blaming and uh, it actually gives us the energy and the power to take care of minute details now. So I think that's an exciting thing to look at. 